Hello everyone, welcome to the Codeverse. In this video, we will learn about what is mean by immutable strings and why strings are immutable in Java. So, what is mean by strings are immutable in Java? Immutable means once defined, we cannot change it. Consider a string str1 and initialize its value to string1. So, strings are immutable. Does it mean I cannot change the value of str1 to something else? Actually, no. I can change its value to something else by using simple equal to operator. So, then what does immutable string means? Answer to this question lies in how strings are stored in a backend of Java. Java stores string in a separate space which is called as string pool. So, when we initialize string1 is equal to codeverse, then it will create an object in a string pool with a value as a codeverse and string1 will point to that object. So, now suppose we want to define an another string with the same value, then another string won't create an separate object in a string pool. It will just point to the same old object. In our case, it is codeverse. Now, if I want to modify the value of string1 to something else, then Java will create an another object in string pool with value something else. In another programming languages, if we try to use equal to operator, then it will modify the existing value of a string. But in Java, instead of modifying the object value in string pool, Java creates a new object of that string. So, we cannot modify the objects in a string pool once created. That's why strings are immutable in Java. Now let's understand why Java developer decided to make strings immutable. First reason is to save memory. When we create 10 objects with the same value, then instead of creating 10 different objects, Java will create only one object in string pool and all 10 objects will point to it. So it saves a lot of memory. Second reason is Java uses multi-threading. If multiple threads are accessing the string and trying to modify its value at the same time, then it will create a serious security issues. So, immutable strings makes multi-threading more efficient in Java. The third reason is string is used in many collections as a key of a collection. So, if we keep modifying the string, then our collection will also get affected with it. So, for efficient collection implementation, Java developer decided to make strings immutable. That's it for today's video. If you like this video, then please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.